Today's Strat-O-Matic football game features the 1985 New England Patriots visiting the 2022 Buffalo Bills. The Buffalo Bills lost in the 2022 playoffs to the Kansas City Chiefs in a wild overtime game, while the New England Patriots were beaten soundly in Super Bowl XX by the Chicago Bears. Both are excellent teams, but for differing reasons. The Bills have a prolific passing attack while the Patriots had a staunch defense and devastating ground attack. So sit back and enjoy this game from across the decades brought to you as only the sportsman can. Hello, sports fans and football fans. It's me, Sportsman Z. And today I've got what should be another good matchup for you. This is going to be the 2020 Buffalo Bills hosting the 1985 New England Patriots. Now, if you recall, the 2020 or the 2023, or 2022, the 2022 Buffalo Bills. That's that's the team. <laughs> that's the ticket. Now, if you recall, the 2022 uh, Buffalo Bills, I believe, were in the AFC Championship game and lost to Kansas City. Uh, and the, you will recall, the 1985. Patriots uh, were in the Super Bowl and got crushed by the Bears. So, um, unfortunately, I have some out, or well, I have the recent Patriots helmet, um, the current Patriots helmet, instead of the 1985 version, which I wish I had, but I don't. And I have an outdated Bills helmet, which is the red one that they had uh, a few years ago. But that's, uh, you know, that's just the way it's got to go. Um, and uh, the football games, I'll be doing them the way I usually do them. So if you've been following along and you've watched the other football games, you know the way that I'm doing this one um, with the uh, timer going one tick on every play. And uh, except for kicks and kickoffs. And uh, let's see, what else do we want to get out of the way? Ah, the Buffalo defense. The Buffalo defense is good to excellent against runs and average against passes. And the New England defense is excellent against runs and good to excellent against passes. And uh, we will get to the teams as they uh, come out. But uh, the uh, Bills will kick off. They are home and they get to elect. The, if you know how I do it, the home team always just automatically gets to decide. And they will kick off and defer to the second half. So we will roll the dice for the kickoff. And it is a seven, and seven is to the five, number two. So the Patriots will receive the ball at the five-yard line, and their number two back is going to return it. And the number two kickoff turner is the same as the first one, and that's Stefan Starring. And he gets an eight, which is on the Bills' return card. And that is going to be 17 yards. So not a great field position for the uh, for the Patriots starting out here, they're only at the 22-yard line. And that will bring up the Patriots' offense out onto the field. Now, uh, the Patriots, if you remember, the starting quarterback for the Patriots for most of the year was Tony Eason, but I'm going with Steve Grogan because Steve Grogan was my favorite player growing up as a kid. Steve Grogan, 6'4", 210 pounds out of Kansas State. Uh, he played there from 72 to 74, and he was a fifth-round pick of the Patriots in 1975. And uh, his uh, running backs are going to be uh, Tony Collins and Craig James. And um, the split end will be Stanley Morgan. The tight end will be Derek Ramsey, and the flanker is going to be Irving Fryer. So with that, let's get underway with this. Um, and oh, oh yeah, we have to pick a play. I didn't even pick a play. So we're gonna go. We're gonna start off with uh, an end run with Tony Collins. So we got Tony Collins going end run, and that is an eleven end run on the Buffalo defense, and uh, that's gonna be eight yards. So nice pickup by Tony Collins. It's second and two, and uh, on second and two, they're gonna go. Line buck with line buck with Craig James. And that's going to be an 11 on the line buck on the uh, 
Buffalo defense, and that is going to be negative one. So they knock him back one, and we've got a third and three. Third and three, the Patriots will go flat pass to their tight end, and of course the tight end is uh, Derek Ramsey. So that is a seven on the flat pass defense for the Bills, and that is going to be a short gain. Short gain there. And that's a six, which is, uh, I think it's like 16 yards. It is indeed 16 yards. So they're all the way out to the 40-yard line, uh, their own 40. So the Patriots are going into action at their own 40. And they're going to go long. First down, they're going to go long to Stanley Morgan. And uh, so let's see. But that, oh, there's a possible penalty, and the possible penalty is on the um, Bills. But let's see, 10 on a long pass for the Bills is going to be a receiver. And that is a 9 on Stanley Morgan, long pass. And uh, they were, were they, uh, Oh, we don't know if they were looking for it. We got to roll the dice and see if they were looking for it. Eight. And eight is going to be... No, they were not looking for it. So it is a long gain. Wait a minute. Let's see. Now, yep, it is. It's a long gain. And we'll roll the dice for the long gain. And that would be seven. And so that's going to be 35, 38 yards. But let's see if the Bills had a penalty. They would probably uh, deny it or, you know, not... Opponent number seven, so it's really on the Patriots. So that's why we have to roll it. Um, opponent number seven on all pass situations. And it's uh, illegal procedure five yards from the original line of scrimmage. So they're going to have a second and 15. Or a first and 15, sorry. First and 15. They're going to do the same thing, except they're going to go long to Fryer this time. And that is a two on a long pass on the Bills' defense. And uh, it's going to be 29 yards, 2 to 6 or 12. So let's roll the dice. Eight. It's incomplete. So it's going to be second and 15. And they're going to go end run with Tony Collins. End run with Collins, nine on the Bills' defense is going to be negative one. So now it's third and 16. Third and 16, they're going to go short pass to Stanley Morgan. Short to Stanley Morgan, six on the Bills' defense is going to be 11 yards. So they have a decision to make here um, because they have a fourth and five. And they are right at the 50-yard line. They're going to punt the ball. So the punt is a 10, which is good because it's a it's a, a generally a bad punt, but it, the, where they are, it's fine. 37 back one. So that would be 10, 20, 30, 5, 6, 7, and the punt return back one for Buffalo on the punt return is um, Naheem Hines. He gets a 10. And that's going to be 18 yards. Mahim Hines returns at 18 yards. That's big. 2, 15, 17, 18. And the Bills will go first, go, into, uh, go to work first and 10 at their own 31 yard line. Now, uh, Josh Allen will be bringing their offense out on the field. Of course, Josh Allen, 6'5", 235 pounds out of Wyoming. He was the first-round pick of the Bills in 2018, made the Pro Bowl in 2020 and 2022. 
And he will be out there with his running backs will be Devin Singletary James, and James Cook. His split end will be Gabriel Davis. Flanker will be Stefan Diggs. The tight end will be Dawson Knox. So they're going to go in into work here, and they're going to go end run with Devin Singletary. And that's going to be a four on Singletary's card, but they were right. They, uh, oh, yeah, we have to see if they were right or wrong. And that is a seven. They were wrong. They were just barely wrong. Um, so end run, Singletary, seven is five yards. So they got a second and five. Second and five, they're going to go off tackle with James Cook. And that is a seven off tackle with Cook, and they are looking for the pass. So that is going to be a short gain. Short gain for James Cook. Roll the dice, it's a nine. Nine on the short gain is 13 yards for the Bills. So four, 10, and back it off one there at the 49-yard line. They're just a yard shy of midfield. And they're going to go long on first down. They're going to go long to Stefan Diggs. Trying to catch the Patriots napping here. And that's going to be a 12. Long pass 12 on Allen's card is incomplete. So that's going to be a second and 10. And they're going to go end run with the halfback, uh, Devin Singletary. And that's going to be a 12 end run on the Patriots defense. And that's going to be eight yards. So let's see, six eight and it looks like they are two yards short so they've got a uh, third and two third and two they're going to go flat to the tight end Dawson Knox that's going to be a five flat pass on New England's defense and uh, that's going to be a short game and that is an eight so that is 14 yards for the Bills. Three, 10, and one. So now they're down to the Patriots' 29-yard line. And they have a first and 10. And I'm keeping the clock moving here. They're going to go short to the split end. So this pass, this pass is targeting Gabriel Davis. That is a four short pass on the Patriot defense. And uh, that's going to be intercepted two to eight or 12, two to six or 12. Nine, it is not in intercepted, it's incomplete. So it's going to be second and 10. They're going to go end run with Singletary. Patriots are probably frustrated they're running so much because they don't expect that to happen. They got an eight, and they are, um, let's see, nine. Uh, let's see if they're looking. They are looking for the pass. So, um, so an eight on an end run on Singletary is going to be three yards. They got a second and seven. Second and seven coming up. They're going to go flat to the tight end. That's going to be a seven flat pass on the New England D. And that's going to be a incomplete. So they've got a third and seven. Third and seven, they're going to go short to the split end. And uh, that's going to be... Um, that's going to be uh, Gabriel Davis. And that's a seven. And they are looking for the pass. 
and it is still 12 yards, 12 yards and a first down. So the, the Bills are surprisingly moving on the uh, New England defense of 1985, which was a good, really good defense. We're going to go end run with the halfback, and that's going to be uh, Devin Singletary. That is an eight on the uh, end, end run. Yep, end run of the uh, New England defense. That's going to be zero yards. So they've got a second and ten. They're going to go short again. They're going to go back to Dawson Knox, short to the tight end, Dawson Knox. And that's going to be a five. Possible penalty, though, on the Bills. Uh, let's see what that is. That's incomplete. But let's see if they had a, have a penalty now. Eight. Opponent number four. So that's on New England. New England has their second penalty of the game. That is a... Um, Let's see. Number four is a personal foul 15 yards from concluding line of scrimmage and a first down. So uh, we are within 15 yards. So, or, or yes, we are. So it's going to be half the distance. And so it'll be like eight yards. And a first down from, it's going to be a first and goal for the Bills from the seven-yard line. And they're going to go end run with Singletary on first down. And that's going to be a six, end run six on the New England defense. It's going to be a yard. So it's going to be... Second and goal from the six. They're going to go short to the split end. Short to Davis. And that's going to be a 12 short pass on the New England defense. And that's going to be a long game, which is going to be automatically a touchdown. There's no penalty. And the extra point for the Bills misses on 12. And it doesn't. So it is seven nothing Bills here. And... Uh, And the Bills take a 7-0 lead, and they'll kick off. And we have to move it. And two is a, on a kickoff is a touchback. So the Patriots will have it at the 25-yard line. Going to use the, uh, we're going to use today's rules because it is the Bills. I think that comes out to the 25. Um... Maybe it's a 20. It might be the 20. I'll, I'll put it on the 20. All right, so uh, first and 10 from the 20-yard line for the Patriots. They're going to come out, and they're going to go long to Stanley Morgan again on first down. And that's an 11, long pass 11. You know that's going to be possibly intercepted. Um... Grogan doesn't have a high interception rate, though, and they were looking for it. So it's intercepted 2-9. to nine. That is, That's pretty high, though. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah. 8. It is intercepted 28 yards down the field. 10, 20, 5, and 8. And they're returning the interception from that point. And that is an eight on the interception return. And that's going to be four yards. So the Bills have it first and ten at the Patriot 44-yard line because Steve Grogan threw an ill-advised pass that got picked off by the Bills' defense. And now they're going to go end run with the halfback, Devin Singletary, because that's been working. Frankly, that's been working. 11 end run Singletary, and they are looking for the pass, I believe. No, they're looking for the run. They are looking for the run, and that is an 11 on end run, and that is going to be two yards. So they got a second and eight. They're going to go short to the split end, and... 
That is, uh, that's Gabriel Davis. That is a 10, short pass 10 on Josh Allen's card is 11 yards and a first down. So 2, 5, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and there have it. First and 10 at the Patriots 31. The Bills are taking it to the, uh, to the Patriots here. It's surprising. End run for Devin Singletary. And they're doing it running the ball mainly. And uh, seven, Devin Singletary, seven, looking for the uh, run. Is going to be negative. That is going to be a negative five yards. That was huge right there. That was big for the Patriots. So now they got a second and 15. They're going to go short to the um, short to the flanker. They're going to go short to uh, to uh, Stefan Diggs. That's going to be a six short pass for Allen. That's going to be uh, they are looking for. Let's see, one to twelve pass. They are looking for the. They're looking for the run. So that is going to be incomplete. Incomplete second or third and uh, 15. Third and 15, they're going to go short to the tight end, Dawson Knox. And that is going to be, they are, I believe they're looking for it. Yeah, they are. They're looking for it. And that is a four on a short pass. And that's going to be 14 yards, though, even though they're looking for it. Still, that's not a first down. That's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. They have a fourth and one coming up. Tough decision here for the Bills. On fourth and one, they're going to go... Let's see. They're going to do an end run with the quarterback. They're going to do an end run with um, with Josh Allen. And that is a five. And they were, let's see, fourth and one. One to 13 pass. So they're looking for the pass. And uh, that's a five. And five is a fumble zero, two to five. And it isn't, but it is zero yards. So he doesn't, wait a minute. Yeah. So he doesn't get anything. And the Patriots have a big stop right there. The, the Bills thought maybe they could uh, sneak one in get you know get the uh, first down but they didn't and so the Patriots are gonna come out and they're gonna go short to Stanley Morgan on first down and that's gonna be a, an eight on Grogan's card when they are looking I believe for the run yeah so an eight, I think that's going to be receiver. It is, and we'll go refer to Stanley Morgan's card. Five on the short pass for Stanley Morgan is 17 yards. Three, 10, and four. And the Patriots have a first and 10 at, the, uh, at their own 39-yard line. And the, the quarter is running down here. The first quarter is almost over. They're going to have a first and 10 from the 39. And they're going to go end run with Tony Collins. And that's going to be a 10 end run on the Bills defense. And that's going to be negative two. So now it's second and 12. They're going to go off tackle with... Um, off tackle with Craig James. And that's going to be a six off tackle. And they are, let's see, second and 11. 
one to ten pass they are looking for the run so six uh, off tackle is going to be zero yards so they have a third and 12. third and 12 here as the first quarter is winding down uh, they're going to go short to the tight end so this is a short pass to derek Ramsey. And that's a two on Grogan's card, and it's going to be incomplete. So they got a fourth and 12, and they're going to punt easily. That's a 12. It's a terrible punt. Let's see what happens there. 15 yards, back one. Four, 10, and one. And uh, back one, the punt returner is Naheem Hines. And he gets an 11, which is a fumble negative one. And 2 to 6 or 12, the Bills get it back. They don't. So the Patriots, the Naheem Hines fumbles the punt. And the Patriots take back over again at the uh, Bills 48-yard line. What a turn of events there as the quarter ends and we start the second quarter. Um, and so that means that the Patriots will be going the other way. 48 going the other way and they're going to go end run with Tony Collins and that's going to be a six end run and they are looking for the run so six end run on Tony Collins is zero yards when looking for it so second and ten they're going to go flat to the tight end so this is going to be a flat pass to Derek Ramsey and that's going to be a six flat pass and they are looking for the pass and that's going to be seven yards so Grogan does roll out and manages to hit the tight end for a seven yard gain. You've got a third and three coming up. They're going to go off tackle with Craig James. Off tackle with James six, and that's a 10. Let's see, third and three. I think it was third and three. Um, let's see, one to 10 pass. They are looking for the pass. And so it's a six, uh, off tackle, right? Yep. Off tackle six on Craig James is four yards and a first down. So the Patriots have it first and 10 at the 38 of the Bills. Still not really in field goal range, or at least good field goal range. They're going to go end run with Tony Collins on first and 10. And that's going to be a nine end run on their defense. And that's going to be negative one. So they have a second and 11. They're going to go short to Stanley Morgan. Short to Stanley Morgan, six on second and like 11. One to 10 pass. They are looking for the pass. So short pass six. Grogan is a must run when they're looking for it. Of course, this was when he was older. He wasn't quite as good at running. And he has a fumble negative four. So he loses four yards, and two to six or 12, they get it back. Eight, they don't, and so the Bills take over. That was a big mistake there by the Patriots, because now the Bills have it first and 10 going the other way with good field position, and uh, they're going to go long pass to the flanker, long to Stefan Diggs. 
and that's going to be a nine and it's on the Patriots defense long and that's going to be negative eight yards and a sack they sack um they sack uh Allen for eight yards and now it's going to be second and 18 they're going to go short to the split end they have some time to get that yardage back that is a nine and they are looking for let's see second probably looking for the pass one to twelve pass they are looking for it and it's a nine uh short pass nine on allen's card is incomplete so they've got a third and 18 coming up they're gonna go long to digs And that is a nine long pass on the New England defense. And that is going to be the negative eight that I think we already had once. And so now with a fourth and forever easily, the Bills are going to punt the ball. And that is a six. Six on the punt is 51 back two. So three, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. And back it off, too. They are returning from, the Patriots are returning this from their own 22-yard line. And a four is going to be a fair catch. So the Patriots will go into, go to work there at their own 22. Not what they wanted when they were in Bill's territory last time and Grogan fumbled. They're going to come out and go long. They're going to go long to Stanley Morgan. They're going to keep trying here. Knocking at the door. Six long pass on the Buffalo defense. And that is going to be intercepted 32 yards, 2 to 5, 11 or 12. Let's see if he's picked off. He is not, but it is incomplete. So Grogan is not doing real well here. They're going to go end run with Collins on second and 10. And that's going to be a four end run on the Buffalo defense. And that's going to be eight yards. So they got a third and two. Third and two, they're going to go line buck with Craig James. And that's going to be an eight line buck on the Bills defense. And it's going to be zero. So no yardage gain there. And they've got a fourth and two. And they are going to punt the ball. They're only losing seven, nothing here. But another terrible punt by New England. It's going to be 31. This is Rich Camarillo. And it's surprising he's doing this bad, but that's 31 back one. So 10, 20, 30, and one. And back one returning it for Buffalo. And that is a nine. And that's going to be a fair catch. So Buffalo goes to work at their own 39-yard line. And... They will go end run with Devin Singletary. And that's going to be an eight end run on the New England defense. And that's going to be zero yards. So they got a second and ten. They're going to go off tackle with the other back. Um, that's Cook, I think. And, yeah, let's... Uh, Cook is going to get six line, what is that, a line buck, or off tackle. Off tackle six is going to be two yards. So they got a third and eight coming up. Third and eight, they're going to go short to the split end. And the split end is... I think his name is Owens. No, it's Gabriel Davis. All right, Gabriel Davis. And that is a nine. And they are looking for, let's see, third and eight. 
one to 14 pass and just misses. They were looking for the run. So this is going to be a, a short pass. Nine is receiver, I think, on Allen's card. It is. And so we refer to Gabriel Davis, or um, yeah, Gabriel Davis. And, oh, wait a minute. No, that's uh, eight on Allen is receiver. It is receiver anyway. So it is. And that is a four on Gabriel Davis. And that's going to be 17 yards. So that's a big pickup there for the Bills. Um, three, 10, and four. The Bills have it first and 10 in Patriots territory at their at the Patriots 41-yard line. They're going to go end run with Devin Singletary on first down. The run seems to be working a little better for them. Six. And they are looking for the run. Uh, so six and run is negative six. Four, six. So they got a second and 16. Second and 16, they're going to go long to the flanker. So long to Stefan Diggs. And that's an 11 long pass on the Patriots defense. And it's going to be... 11 is a long gain. Wow. So let's see what they can get out of that. Seven. Long gain seven is 38 yards. Two, 10, 20, 30, and five, and one. So now it's a first and goal for the Bills at the nine-yard line. That passed to Stefan Diggs, who was born... November 29th, 1993, in Gaithersburg, Maryland, which is where I happen to currently live myself. And he was a fifth-round selection by the Vikings out of the University of Maryland in 2015. So you've got the Bills with a first and ten here, and time running out, down, running down in the half. They're going to go end run with Devin Singletary. And that's going to be a seven. And we are looking for the run. The uh, the Patriots are looking for the run. And that is a seven. And uh, this is an end run on Singletary. And that's going to be a negative five. He loses big yards again. So it's going to be second and goal now from the 14-yard line. And they're going to go short pass to the split end, Davis. Or who is the split end again? Yes, Gabriel Davis. And that is a two, short pass two on the New England defense. And that's going to be 15 yards, two to eight, 11 or 12. If this is good, it's a, it's a, it's a touchdown. It is a nine. It is not. It's incomplete. So now they've got a third and goal from the 14, from the 14-ish yard line. They're going to go short pass to the tight end, Dawson Knox. They're, Allen's going to roll out and try to find Knox in the end zone. That is a 10 short pass on the New England defense. And that is going to be incomplete. So the Bills have to kick a field goal from there, uh, from the 14 their field goal is, and this is Tyler Bass, who you know famously missed uh, a game-tying field goal recently against Kansas City. It's 2-9 to nine or 12, it's good. It is, mm, it is, it is good. Wait, six, no, it isn't. It's, wait, 6 and 4 is 10, so no, it misses. It does miss. So it's no good, and the Patriots are going to take over right there. So we got a little back and forth here, and, you know, my math is, is really terrible, and it always has been. But we've got a uh, first and ten for the Patriots here. They're going to go end run with uh, Tony Collins. And that's going to be a five end run, and they are, let's see, on the Buffalo defense, that's going to be a fumble of some sort, probably. Fumble, negative three, two to seven or twelve, he fumbles. He does, and 2-6 or 12, he gets it back. He does, but 
he loses three yards. So it's going to be a second and 13. And now we're down to the two-minute warning, so time will not move on this play. And Grogan is going to go short to Stanley Morgan. Try to get him out of there. And that is a four. And they are looking for the run, I believe, right? Second and one to ten pass. So they are looking for they're looking for the run, and it's a short pass four on Grogan's card. And that's incomplete. So we may have to bring Eason in. The time doesn't move on that. We'll have to bring Eason in maybe in the second half. End run for Craig James on third and forever here. And they're only looking pass. I'm just going to say they're only looking pass. It doesn't matter. It's on the defense card. Eight. End run eight on the Buffalo defense is zero yards. And so the Patriots will have to punt. That time, the time does move. And the punt is a nine, which isn't particularly good. Camarillo gets off a 42 with back one returning. So 4, 10, 20, 30, 40. And back two is returning from the 48 of the Patriots already. Um, 9. And that's going to be a fair catch. So fair catch for Buffalo right there. They do have their timeouts, so they are going to try to work this down into scoring position. They're going to go short to the split end, and they're going to call their first timeout, so time won't move on this. And that is a six, and they are looking for the pass. Six short pass is must run when they're looking for it. Of course, this is Josh Allen, so... And a two is a 44-yard run. <laughs> oh, my God. Unbelievable. He, they flush him out of the pocket, and he only all he does is run for 44 yards, which is um, going to put it down at the four-yard line. And time didn't move so because they called timeout. Now they're not even going to call timeout because they're close enough that they should make it. Off tackle with the halfback. They're going to go off tackle with Devin Singletary. And... Um, that's going to be a nine, and they are looking for the run. Yes. Nine off tackle, and there's a possible penalty on the Bills. So let's see. Nine off tackle is only going to be a yard. Let's see if the Bills have a penalty. That's a 10. That's going to be number seven. They do have a penalty. On a run, seven is a legal procedure, five yards from the original line of scrimmage. So they're going to have a, uh, a second. Did they already run a play before that? I don't know if they did. I think that's going to be first and goal from the eight. Let's just say it's going to be first and goal from the eight. And they're going to go short to the split end. They're going to they they're trying to punch it in right now. They don't want to play around anymore. There's a possible penalty though on the Patriots. That is an 8 though. Uh short pass. Short pass 8 on the New England defense is negative 8. So they it, they sack Allen, but let's see if there's a penalty on the Patriots. 2 is going to be offsetting penalties. So it's going to be uh, it's going to be a first again a first and goal again, and they're going to go end run with a halfback Devin Singletary. End run Singletary. That's an eight. They are uh, looking for the pass. End run, eight, and that's going to be three yards. And so now you got a second and goal from the five, 
and they're going to go short pass to the split end of course inside where they are now you can't throw a flat pass you're going to do short to the split end and that is a seven and they are looking for the the uh run and short pass seven is going to be 12 yards and a touchdown and the extra point is good and so it is 14 nothing bills and the uh, the logo is coming up off the field that's so excited and we're going to do the uh, kickoff that is a six on the kickoff which is to the three number one so the patriots will take the ball at the three and the number one back That is a seven. It's going to be on the Bills uh, kickoff return, which is 20 yards. So it's going to be out to the 23. The Patriots, again, not with good field position, but they're only going to do the, uh, they're down 14, nothing, but they're just going to try to run out the clock here and go into halftime down 14, nothing. They're going to go off tackle with a halfback. And that's going to be Collins. And that is a six. The Bills are only looking for pass. We're just going to say they're only looking for the pass. So six off tackle Collins is seven yards. And second and three. They're going to go end run with Craig James. Five. That's a possible fumble. Um... So let's see, end run five. It's fumble negative, th negative two, two to four. And it, it isn't, so he loses, but he loses two yards. And the Bills aren't even going to call timeout. Both sides content to just go into the halftime. It's going to be a third and like uh, third and five, maybe. I got third and five. We're going to go flat pass to the tight end. Flat to the tight. It's a five. And uh, that's going to be uh, 10 yards. 10 yards on a first down. And this is going to be the last play of the first half. And Grogan is going to launch it. Launching it to... Um, Irving Fryer, and that is a six, long pass six, is going to be must run for him, and 12 is a negative five, so he lost five yards on that, and that's how we go into halftime with the Bills of 2022 leading the 1985 Patriots 14 nothing, incredibly. All right, well, we're back for the second half of this football game between the 2022 Bills and the, tw the 1985 New England Patriots. Uh, the Bills will be receiving the kickoff as they had deferred in the first half. There is a couple of changes for um, only the New England Patriots. Uh, they will have Stefan Starring at flanker in the second half and the new quarterback will be Tony Eason replacing my man main man Steve Grogan Grogan did not have a very good first half and so they uh, the Patriots have decided they need to go to Eason to try to get something going here down 14 nothing so we will do the kickoff and the kickoff is a 10 and that's going to be to the 12 number two so the Bills receive it at the 12, and the return on an 8 is going to be on the New England return card, and that's going to be 16 yards. So 3, 10, and 3, and so the Bills will go into, um, they will go into action at the, uh, huh, oh, here we go. Here's my 10 yard marker. If I can get it out of there. They will go into action at their own uh, 28 yard line. 
first and 10, and they will do a long pass to the flanker, coming right out here. They're getting right down to business, and that is an eight, and uh, it's on the New England long pass defense eight, which is going to be receiver, and they were going to the the flanker, so uh, that is um, that is Stefan Diggs, and that is a ten, and it is going to be twenty six yards. So a twenty six yard pass by Allen to. 10, 20, and 4. And uh, with just one play, they are one play into the second half of this ball game. They are in New England territory. And have another first down, and they're going to go end run with Devin Singletary. And that is going to be a seven end run on the New England defense, which is very good. And that's going to be only a yard. So they got a second and nine. And they're going to go off tackle with the fullback, and this that being James Cook. And that is a six off tackle on the New England defense. And that is going to be only two yards. So they have a Third and seven coming up. They're going to go flat to the tight end. So they are, on this, they are targeting Dawson Knox. And that is going to be a seven, flat pass seven, when they are looking for the run. And uh, that's going to be eight yards and a first down. So three, five is an eight. And a first down for the Bills. They keep the chains moving. And they're going to go end run with the halfback, Devin Singletary. And that is going to be an eight end run on the New England defense, which is going to be zero yards. They got a second and ten. They're going to go short to the split end. Short pass to uh, Gabriel Davis. Who is still in the game. Five short pass on the New England defense. Is going to be receiver. And that is a 12. And a 12 short pass. They were looking for, let's see, an 8. On second and, second and 10. 1 to 10 pass, so they were looking for the pass, so it's incomplete. So it is third and 10 for the Bills. They're going to go flat to Dawson Knox again. It worked the last time. They're going to try it again. And that is a three on the flat pass. And that's going to be a short gain. And that is a three. That's a really good short gain. That is going to be 19 yards. And so the Bills have it first and 10 again, now at the Patriot 16-yard um, line. You would think the Patriots really can't allow uh, another touchdown here. So we'll see if they can hold them out. It's going to be an end run for Devin Singletary. And that is a nine. Nine end run is going to be... They were looking for the run, so... It's three yards. So it's a second and seven. And they're going to go short pass to Dawson Knox because that keeps working. Because frankly, that keeps working. Nine short pass on the New England defense. That is receiver. It's Dawson Knox. That is a four. And four on short pass is going to be ten yards. And that will get them down to three. It's a first and goal for the Bills at the three-yard line. They're going to go off tackle with um, James Cook. And that's going to be an eight. 
and there's a possible penalty on the Bills. But let's see, eight off tackle is going to be, um, they were looking for, let's see. They were looking for the run, so that is only going to be one yard, but let's see if they had a penalty. Seven. They didn't, so they only got the one yard, and it is second and goal from the two, and they're going to go line buck with the quarterback. They're going to go line buck with... Um, with uh, Josh Allen here. And that's going to be a nine. Nine on the line buck. And they were right. And that's going to be a fumble zero, two to six. Seven, it's not, so it's zero yards. So they have a third and goal from the two. Third and goal from the two. They're going to go line buck with, uh, with James Cook. And that is going to be a five. And line buck five when they were, what were they? Were they right? They were not right. So they, um, so they were looking for the pass. It's a five line buck which is fumble zero, two to seven. It is a fumble and two to six or 12, they get it back. They don't. And so the Patriots have held by forcing a fumble by James Cook and they have the ball at the two yard line with a first and 10. But they are deep in their own end. So they're gonna come out and they're gonna go off tackle with uh, they're going to go off tackle with Craig James. Craig James, as you might remember, out of SMU. And he was dr actually drafted into the USFL by the Washington Federals. And he gets a seven, and there's a possible penalty on the Patriots. But um, let's see what a seven on off tackle is for James. And it's going to be four yards with them being, oh, wait a minute. Let's see if they were right. They were right, so it would be four yards, but let's see if the Patriots have a penalty. That's a seven. They don't, so it'll be four yards. One, two, three, four, and they have a second and six. The Patriots do. And they're gonna go end run with um, Tony Collins. And that is going to be a six end run. And let's see here. They were looking for the, they were looking for the run. And this is a, um, a six, six end run. And that's going to be zero when they're looking for it. So it's going to be third and six. Third and six, they're going to go flat to the tight end. And that is a five flat pass on the Buffalo defense. And that's going to be seven yards and a first down, just barely. So the Patriots do get out of that funk out from under the shadow of their own goalpost, and they have a first and 10. And they're gonna go end run with Craig James again. And that is a seven end run on the Buffalo defense. And that's only gonna be a yard. So it's gonna be second and nine and they're gonna go short to the split end. Tony Eason with his second, only second pass of the game. That's a 12 short pass 
on the Buffalo defense. And that is going to be incomplete. So it's going to be third and nine. Third and nine, they're going to go flat to the tight end. So this one is targeting um, Derek Ramsey. And that's going to be a three flat pass on the Buffalo defense. And that's going to be 23 yards. Wow. 10, 20, and 3. And now the Patriots are really in good shape. They're out at their um, their own 38-yard line. And they have a first down. They're going to go end run with... Um, end run with Craig James. That's going to be a 6 end run looking for the run and that's going to be negative two so they got a second and 12 coming up and they're going to go short pass to the split end stanley morgan and that's going to be a six short pass on eason's card is a double 12 so it's 12 yards four 9, 10, 11, 12, and a first down. Just barely. They barely get the first down. That's exactly what they needed. And so they keep the chains moving. Of course, that pass was to Stanley Morgan, longtime Patriot. He was a first-round selection of the Patriots in 1977 out of Tennessee. So they're going to go end run with Craig James. And that's going to be a 10 end run on the, the uh, Buffalo defense. And that's going to be negative two again. So James loses two yards again and leaves them again with a second and 12. This time Eason's going to air it out. He's going to go long to the flanker. Um, and that is Stefan Starring. And that's going to be a five. Long pass five. And that's a double long gainer, fans. And that is an eight on the long gain chart, which is uh, 41 yards. So three, 10, 20, 30, 40, and then back it off two. And the Patriots have a first and 10 from the... Uh, First and 10 from the Buffalo 12. So what a turn of events here. The Patriots were in imminent trouble of going down 21 nothing just a short time ago. But now it's still only 14 nothing. And if they score a touchdown, they can make it 14-7. They're going to go end run with Craig James. They're trying that. They're going, oh, that's going to be a possible fumble. End run, fumble, negative three. 2 to 7 or 12. So let's roll that. It is a fumble, and 2 to 6 or 12, they get it back. They do get it back, but they lose 3 yards. So Craig James is only losing yards for this team. Not being very productive so far. They're going to do a short pass to Stanley Morgan. So they're going back to the well. And that is a 3 on a short pass on the Buffalo defense. And that's incomplete. So now they have a uh, third and twelve from the uh, from the fort from the fifteen yard line, and they're going to go. They got to go short pass to the tight end. That's what they're going to do, and that is a four short pass on Eason's card, and that's a fourteen yard gain, and that's going to put it down to the one. So the Patriots have a first and goal at the one they gotta love that so they're gonna go line buck with tony collins and that is a 12 line buck on the buffalo defense and that's gonna be negative three so now they've got a second and goal from the four they're gonna go End run with Craig James. They're going back to Craig James. They're showing, you know, some uh, eight end run eight on the Buffalo defense. They're showing their confidence in him. 
but that's a zero yard gain. So now they've got the Patriots are again facing a crucial third down, third and goal from the three yard line. They're gonna go short to the tight end. And that is an 11 on a short pass on the Buffalo defense, which is going to be a long gain, and that's easily a touchdown. They'll roll for the extra point, and they make it, and so they do score seven points. And uh, they make this a really good game. And so the Patriots will kick off. Down only 14-7 now, with the quarter nearly over. The, I mean, each team has only had one possession, I think. And the quarter is almost over. So that is an eight. And the kickoff goes to the six, number one. And in a minute, they're going to be turning around. But right now, it is the six and the number one back. And that is a four, which is 30, 31 yards. So it's out to the 37. So Buffalo has it first and 10 at their own 37-yard line. And they're going to go end run with uh, Devin... Um, with Devin Singletary, yeah. and that is going to be a nine on the uh, nine on the Patriots defense, and that's going to be negative one yard. And they're going to go off tackle with Cook, James Cook, and that's going to be a six off tackle. And um, let's see. One to ten pass. So they are looking for the pass. So this is a uh, off tackle run for James Cook. And a roll of six, which is going to be three yards. So they're going to have a third and eight. And this will be the last play of the second quarter. And third and eight, they're going to go short pass to uh, Stefan Diggs. And that is an eight short pass on the New England defense. And that's going to be negative nine. They did not need that. And that's going to be the... We're switching to the fourth quarter now. And the Bills will be punting from their own 25. So they'll roll for the punt. That's a six. And that's going to be 51 back to 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, and 1. Back two is returning from their own 19. There's only one back anyway, and he gets 16 yards. So 11 and 5, and the Patriots will go into business here at their own 40-yard line. And they're going to go long to the split end. Long, They're going to come out and go long to Stanley Morgan. And that is a four long pass. And I think that is another long game. No, it isn't. No, well, possibly. Let's see. Were they right? Uh, first and 10. They were right, so it's intercepted 31 yards downfield. So Eason is quickly, as he could have been the hero, he could be the GOAT here. 10, 20, 30, and 1. And the interception return by the Bills is 5. And that's 20 yards. Wow. So 10, 20. And they're going to go into business at their own 49-yard line. And the fourth quarter is well underway now. And um, 
they're going to go end run with their half back. Devin, uh, I keep forgetting his name. Devin Singletary. And that is going to be an eight. And they are looking for the... Um, Let's see. They're looking for the run. So that is an eight. And that's going to be zero yards. So second and ten. They're going to throw a long pass to Stefan Diggs. And that is a two long pass on the New England defense. And that's going to be incomplete. So it's going to be third and ten. Third and ten, they're going to go short to their split end. Oh, there was a possible penalty on the New England defense. I almost didn't see that. So let's see if it is. Ten. It isn't. There is no penalty. So it is third and ten. And... Um, Third and ten, they're going to go short to the split end, and that that is um, Daniel D or uh, Gabriel Davis, and that's going to be a two short pass on the New England D, and that's going to be fifteen yards, two to six, eleven or twelve. It is sixteen yards on a first down. So the Bills will have the ball first and 10 at the 36 of the Patriots. And again, I don't think the Patriots can allow a touchdown here. They really can't afford that. They're going to go end run with Devin Singletary. That is a seven end run on the New England defense. And that's only going to be a yard. So second and nine, they're going to go off tackle with Devin, with uh, with James Cook. And that's going to be an eight. And that is going to be, let's see. One to 11 pass. So they're looking for the pass. And that is an eight. Eight off tackle on Cook. And that's going to be four yards. So they have a, like, third and five here. Third and five, they're going to go flat to the tight end. Dawson Knox. That is a seven, flat pass seven on the New England defense. And that's incomplete. So they're going to try, they're going to look at a field goal from the 31. From the 31 yard line, he is two to nine or 12 good. So they're gonna kick the field goal. They're gonna try to kick it. And this time they do make it. And the Bills have a 17 to seven lead on the Patriots and they will kick off. And that is a 12. 12 on the kickoff is a touchback. So the Patriots will have it first and 10 at the 20. And they're going to go end run with the halfback. They have some time here, but they do have to score quickly. Six end run possible penalty on the Bills. But let's see what a six end run is on their defense. It's going to be three yards, but let's see if there was a penalty on Buffalo six is no, there's no penalty. So it's a three yard pickup second and seven for the Patriots. They're going to go off tackle with, um, with Tony Collins. And that is a seven off tackle on the Buffalo defense. And it's going to be zero yards. So now they got a third and, um, third and third and seven. Third and seven, they're going to go flat to the tight end. So this is a flat pass to Derek Ramsey. And that is going to be a nine. I think that's receiver. 
and they were, well, let's just see what it is, six. And this was a flat pass, six is gonna be eight yards. And it is a first down. So the Patriots get a first down, first and 10 at the uh, 31, got the 31 yard line. And uh, they're gonna go, they're gonna go long to Stanley Morgan again. They need, they do need to try to score here quickly. Six, and that's a long pass. And uh, what is that? It could be a receiver, but it's first, let's see, first and 10. They were looking for the run. So, um, so it is, it is receiver. So we're going to look at Stanley Morgan and it's a nine and nine is a long game. Let's roll it a long game. That is a 10, 10 is 50 yards. So it's going to be at the 10, 19, down to the 19 yard line. So the Patriots have first and 10 at the 19. They're going to go end run with a halfback. And uh, this go that's going to be Craig James. That is a nine, end run nine on the Buffalo defense. And that's going to be negative one. So Craig James just can't buy himself a yard here. Uh, it's going to be second and 11. They're going to go flat to the tight end. Flat to the tight end eight on the Buffalo defense. And that's going to be receiver. And that is an eight. Eight on Derek Ramsey is incomplete. So it's going to be third and 11. Third and 11, they're going to go short to Stanley Morgan. They got to go back to Stanley Morgan. Stand the man. And that is a 12. And 12 on short pass on the Buffalo defense is incomplete. So they're going to look at a field goal from the 20, which I'm going to guess they can make. Uh, this is Tony Franklin, after all. And he is 2-10 to 10 good, and they will kick the field. They'll try to kick the field goal. And they do make it. And so it is 17-10. We still have a one-score game here. And the Patriots will kick off. 12. 12 on the kickoff is a touchback. So the Bills will have the ball on their own 20. First and 10. Now they can't rest on their laurels here because they could still, I mean, it's still a one score game. They're going to go end run with Devin Singletary. And that is a six. And they're looking for the run. And that's going to be negative six. I mean, he's feast or famine. That would have been a negative six. You know, it was a negative six since they were looking for it. Could have been a short gain if they weren't. So um, it's going to be second and 16. And you're going to go, they're going to go short to the split end. Short pass eight. That is going to be a, and they're not looking for it. That's going to be a receiver. And that was the, uh, that was the split end. That's a four. And a four short pass is 17 yards. So they've got it first and 10 at the 31. And time is ticking away, tick, tick, ticking away. They're going to go end run with Devin Singl Singletary, I think. <laughs> I think that's his name. Six end run on the New England defense is going to be one yard. So it's going to be second and nine. They're going to go off tackle with the fullback, James Cook. They want to just eat the clock and hope they don't. Ooh, off tackle five on the New England defense. It's going to be fumbled negative one, two to ten. 
and they do fumble. Two to six or 12, they get it back. They do get it back, but they lose a yard, and so now they have a third and 10. Third and 10, they're gonna go short to the split end. And that is gonna be a seven short pass on the New England short pass defense. And that's gonna be negative nine. So they're gonna be punting from deep in their own end and not a moment too soon for New England. And the punt is a seven, which is 49 back one. So three, 10, 20, 30, 40, and six. And that's where New England is gonna return it from, from their own 29 yard line. And uh, back number one. And that is a four. And that's unfortunately for them going to be a fair catch. So they've got a first and 10 there, first and 10 at the 29. They're going to go end run with a halfback. End run with a halfback four on the Buffalo defense is going to be eight yards. Wait a minute, is it eight or nine? It's eight. Eight yards. So they've got a second and two. And they're going to go line buck with the fullback. So line buck with uh, Tony Collins. And that's going to be a two line buck. And they are looking for the run. And it's going to be eight yards. They've got it first and 10 at their own 45 and the two minute warning, so time won't move on this. They're gonna go short to Stanley Morgan, short pass to Stanley Morgan. And that is gonna be a seven short pass and they are looking for the run. Short pass. Um, short pass seven, and that's going to be 11 yards. And we're going to say from now on, the Bills are looking for the pass because that really shouldn't have, they really shouldn't have been looking for the run there. But, um, well, I don't know with two minutes left, but anyway, they're only looking for the pass right now because that's what New England really needs to do. If they run the ball like they're going to do right now, they uh, risk scoring too slowly, but it's going to be an end run for the halfback, Craig James. And that's a 10 end run on the Buffalo D. And that's going to be negative two. He's just really, I mean, all he's gotten is negatives in this, in this half. So it's a second and 12. They're going to go short to the split end again with the, oh, wait a minute, possible penalty on the Bills. I did not see that. So let's roll that. Seven, I don't think there is. There isn't. So short pass to the split end, Stanley Morgan. That is an eight short pass on Buffalo. And that's going to be a negative... What is that, a negative nine? Negative nine on the Buffalo defense. So trouble for New England here. They've got a third and forever. Third and forever, they're gonna go long to the flanker, long to Stefan Starring. And it's a possible penalty on the Patriots, but it's a seven. And seven would be a must run, which is not going to get them very much of anything. Well, a two, it's a 23-yard gain. That might be a first down, I don't know, but let's see if they had a penalty. Four. Number five, they did. And on a pass, 
five is holding 10 yards from the line of scrimmage. So it's third down all over again, but this time they really are going to need to, uh, they're really going to need to go long. They're going to go long to Stanley Morgan this time. And that is a 10, long pass 10 on Eason's card. Looking for it is intercepted 2 to 10. And it is. It's intercepted uh, 20, 33 yards downfield. 10, 20, 30, and 3. And Buffalo is returning from their own 32-yard line, returning it on the interception. That is an 11. And 11 on interception return is 22 yards plus a fumble. 3, 10, 20. Back it off one. Two to six or 12, they get it back. They don't. So the Patriots pick it up right there. But they have it first and 10, but they're further back than they were before. And uh, now they got to, they really do have to move fast here. They're going to go short to Stanley Morgan. And that is an eight. Short pass eight is incomplete because they were looking for it. They're going to call their first time out. They're going to go long to Stefan Starring. And there's a possible penalty on Buffalo. Seven long pass on the Buffalo defense it is going to be a negative nine sack. But let's see if Buffalo had a, had a defensive penalty nine. Opponent offsides, but they're going to refuse that because it is a sack for nine yards. And the time didn't move, and they're going to take their second time out. And this is like third and forever right here. And they're going to go long to Stanley Morgan. And that's an 11 long pass on the Buffalo defense. And that's going to be... 32 yards, nice. 3, 10, 20, 30, and back it off, 1. And now they're going to call their third and final timeout, so time won't move here. And they're going to go long to Stefan Starring. And that is a 6, long pass 6 on Eason, it's incomplete. And now they've exhausted all their timeouts, so they've only got the plays that are left. It's second and ten. They're going to go long to the split end, Stanley Morgan. And that is a two, long pass two, incomplete, because they were looking for it. So it's third and ten. Uh, they're going to go short. They'll try short here to the split end, or short to uh, the... Uh, the flanker, Stefan Starring, higher percentage, nine, short pass on the Buffalo defense, is receiver, and Stefan Starring we will look at on the short pass, seven, it's incomplete. So this is it, fourth and, fourth and, uh, fourth and ten right here. They're going to go short to the split end, Stanley Morgan. And that is a five, short pass five. It's going to be a must run. Eason is out on his own, running around, running around. It's a five. It's seven yards. He does not get the first down. And Buffalo will take over right there. And all they have to do is really victory formation, but we don't have that. So we're just going to go off tackle with the fullback. So it's going to be off tackle with James Cook. And that is a six. And that is going to be three yards. And that's how the game ends with your final score being the Bills 17 and the Patriots 10.